Alright, welcome to my Let's Play for Atelier Sophie, the Alchemist of the Mysterious Book. Um, I'm a pretty big Atelier fan, played pretty much... Uh, well, I guess I started playing them when the with the PS3 ones, so Atelier Verona was my first one. And i played every single one since then, um, and really enjoy them. So this is the first one that's on the PS4. Um, so I am playing this on the PS4. I believe it came out on the Vita as well. Um, not sure in North America, but definitely in Japan it came out on the Vita. Um, but anyways, we are looking at the PS4 version here. Uh, let's jump right into a... Let me just go into the settings real quick here. That a little bit lower, that a little lower, that a little higher. That's fine. And as always, the horizontal camera always inverted for me. Everything else looks good. And let's jump into a new game. Pretty excited for this. I do really, really enjoy Atelier games, so. Okay, break time's over. Now back to work. I need to put in the puni ball and then add the uni after boiling it for a little while. Yeah, this is going well. Now I just have to mix it a little and... Huh? This is weird. What's with this color? Oh, it stinks! Oh no, wait! This is Kirchen Bell, a small town brimming with greenery and the sounds of church bells. A certain girl lives alone in this town. Her name is Sophie. Here, she runs an atelier, using the alchemy she learned from her late grandmother. Although, she still has quite a lot of room for improvement. Mm, messed up again. <sighs> At this rate, I'll never be as good as Grandma was. <sighs> if only there was a way to suddenly get really good at alchemy. Then I could make amazing medicine and stuff, and everyone in town would rely on me. <laughs> I wouldn't have any problems if that was the case. <sighs> Guess I should clean up. Oh, yes! It's open! Hello, Sophie. What's that smell? <laughs> I messed up again. More importantly, why are you here, Monica? Do you need something? Yes. There's something I'd like to ask of you. Huh. It's unusual for you to have a request. What do you need? I just met with Meister Horst. He was asking for some Berg medicine, but... I've gone to every shop and I can't find it anywhere. So I thought you might know something. You know, you're kind of an alchemist, right? That's why I'm asking. Kind of one. But Berg medicine, huh? I've never tried making that. I saw Grandma making it before, so I should be able to make it too. It's a request I decided to accept. You don't have to force yourself if it'll be difficult. No, it's fine. I can't just ignore someone in need. Leave it all to me. Oh, but I'm still not confident about it, so I should look for Grandma's book. Okay, so we got, yeah. So we got a uni bag, simple baked sweets, and saute. It was uh, just some free DLC that um, was on PlayStation Network, so I picked it up. I don't know what it is exactly. I'm assuming this is like a... Yeah, it's an offensive item. Um, this is a healing item. 
And another healing item. Okay, so it's just like three useless throwaway items. Um, so what they've done after... Well, I actually found it weird that they pronounced it Atlier, because I think they've pronounced it Atelier in a lot of the other games, but Atlier, we'll call it for this one. Um, Atlier Sophie, and as of Atlier Shally, they've done away with the time system. And I believe they've done away with it in this game too, but in the top corner you still see a clock and a day. Um, but I think that has to do with like the time of day... Like they have like a clock system where like evenings and mornings and stuff like that. Um, and a weekly system, but I don't think there's actual time limits or anything like the other Atlier games. Um, so the setup for this one seems like she's just kind of a pretty crummy alchemist. Who uh, is trying to follow in the footsteps of her grandmother. So let's see if we can find this book here. Uni level pastry making. Nope. How to remove tough stains. Not this either. Um, Monica, I can't find it. That's because you don't keep this place organized. I'll help you clean up again on another day. Just keep looking. Okay, so it's not here. What about here? Find it. Wait, what's this book? What's wrong? It's just that there's a book here that I don't recognize. It has a very elegant binding. I wonder what's inside. Let's take a look. Hmm. I see, I see. Ah, oh, this is a reference book for alchemy! But only the beginning is. The rest of it is all blank pages. Maybe Grandma was writing it. Hmm, I see. Yeah! Anyway, Monica, after looking at this, I suddenly remembered. Huh? Remembered what? How to make the bird medicine! The thing you were asking about! Really? You think you can make it? Of course! I have enough materials so I can mix it up real quick now. Yes, please do so. Just be careful not to make another mistake, okay? I'll be fine. Just leave it to me. So now we can synthesize items. And we can save at the desk. And use the bed to set whatever time we want. Uh, if you return to the Atelier late at night, you'll automatically rest until morning. Okay. Okay, this is different. So we learned Berg Medicine. Um, I actually want to just go back into the settings real quick and put voice a little bit higher. Um, hopefully that'll be a little bit better. Um, so for those of you who don't know, Atelier games are basically comprised of two main components. Basically synthesizing... Well, three. Synthesizing, exploring, and combat. Um, and there's usually a pretty light-hearted story to go along with it. Um, let's just grab our first save here while we're here. Lovely. Um, so we need to go make the bird medicine, so let's do that. So that's the uh, alchemy part. Alright, time to try making it. <laughs> Good luck, Sophie. Leave it to me. Okay, what should I make? We already know what we're gonna make. We're gonna make Berg Medicine. So since this requires you to have the designated items, you can check which recipes you can make by looking at the circle, triangle, cross symbols on the left. You can synthesize now, you can synthesize after making materials, not enough materials, okay. So we can synthesize now, I think is what that means, right? The circle? What material should I use? Some require specific items, some only require categories of items. Yeah, so the alchemy stuff can get a little bit involved. I don't know how much it is in this game, but uh, something I do like exploiting. It's always fun. Um, so these are the same quality, so we'll just throw that in there.
Use count can grow up to three. What? This is weird. Are we using actually 20 of these items in each of the this synthesis? Really okay? All right, Maybe. I'll finish it now. Done. So we made some Berg medicine. It's our first synthesis. And we did not level up our alchemy. <laughs> oh well. But making that... I don't know. Filled it up in this weird chart thingy. Alright, done! Monica, it's ready! Mmm, that's amazing! It really is Berg medicine! Thank you, Sophie. You really helped me out. Don't worry about it. We're friends, right? <laughs> right. Anyway, I'll take this over to Meister Horse now. Hey, Monica. Do you mind if I go along? Huh? I don't mind. But why? I'm the one who made this medicine. If it turned out to be no good, it would mean trouble. Hmm. I think it's fine, but... Well, it couldn't hurt. Let's go. Yeah. Oh, just a minute. I should write the recipe into the reference book while it's still fresh in my mind. Sorry for the wait, Monica. Anyway, let's go see Meister Horst. Okay, that book is a little bit more special than uh, we originally thought. It's kind of odd that she had this book that she didn't even know about. That was her grandmother's, just sitting on a desk. So clearly there's something going on with that book. Meister Horst! Ah, you two. Do you need anything? Meister Horst, I brought the Berg medicine you requested. Oh, thank you very much for bringing it so quickly, Monica. Well, actually, Sophie made it. I couldn't find any Berg medicine myself. Sophie, you made this? Yes. Um, is there something wrong with it? Not at all. In fact, it's quite rare to see Berg medicine as fine as this. It seems your skills with alchemy are improving quite a bit, Sophie. <laughs> you two have been very helpful. Here's your payment. Nice, we got 200 coal. Wow, thank you so much, Meister Horst. Um, I didn't really do anything. I can't accept this. No, no. I'm the one who made such a sudden request. Think of it as a payment for your time. I insist. Very well. I'll accept it gratefully. Thank you too, Sophie. If you're ever troubled by anything, just ask. I'll do whatever I can to help. Anyway, I'll get going now. Have a good day, Meister Horst. Sophie? Yes, have a good day. <sighs> I worked hard today. Huh? What? That book is floating? I... I didn't think books could do that! You just got home, and you're already so loud. Wait, what? Did the book just... talk? Yes, I talked. What? The book... the book is talking? Please just calm down. People are able to talk. It's not strange for a book to talk too. Huh? Um... I don't think that's how it works. Um... So you're that reference book from earlier, right? The one I wrote in? Yes, I'm Plakta. I wonder how Plakta feels about being written in. Oh, you have a name. I'm Sophie. Sophie, I shall remember that. Um, Miss Plakta? 
Just call me Plakta. Uh, okay. Um, Plakta? What exactly are you? A book. I can see that, but... You're a book. Yet you're flying and talking. It's really strange. It's true that I'm different from an ordinary book. That's because I... I... That's strange. I can't remember. What exactly am I? Um, that's what I want to know. Wait, Plakta. Do you not have any memories? It seems so. I can remember that I'm related to alchemy, though. Alchemy? Then I might be able to help! I'm actually an alchemist! Yes, I know. A novice alchemist who doesn't even know how to produce berg medicine. Oh, so you saw that. But I can make it now! Even a child could make that if they studied a little bit. Uh, but, but, Meister Horse praised me for it, saying it was really well made. From my point of view, it didn't appear particularly excellent in any way. Yeah, I'm terrible at alchemy. I make lots of mistakes, and I can't make lots of things. I can't help the people around town like my grandma was able to. Do you wish to become better? Huh? I'm asking you if you wish to become better at alchemy. Of course I do. I would if I could. There is a device called the Cauldron of Knowledge. It allows anyone to use the power of alchemy. With that, you would be able to make free use of alchemy, as you so desire. There's an amazing device like that? I want it! Where can I find it? The Cauldron of Knowledge is... Oh, this is strange. Oh no, don't tell me. Plakta, you forgot where the Cauldron is? It seems so. What? Are you serious? That's terrible! You got my hopes up only to crush them. I am very sorry, but I can't remember at all. As compensation, I can teach you alchemy myself. I may have lost my memories, but I'm confident that my knowledge of alchemy exceeds yours. Hmm, you do seem pretty smart. And you probably do know more about alchemy than me. If you'll teach me, I'll gladly accept. Very well. We'll be working together starting now, Sophie. Yeah! I look forward to it, Plakta. Okay. So... I wonder if the book comes from, like, another time. This is the 17th, uh, tell, uh, at Lear game. Um... We'll just skip this intro here. Maybe? Can we? I guess we can. not Um... Nope, we can't. Alright, so, um, like I was saying, uh, I'm thinking the book comes from, like, a time when alchemy was more prevalent. Because that's one of the themes of all the games I've played, is the world used to be filled with alchemy, and then something happened, and it was kind of forgotten or lost to time. And then there's, like, some sort of novice who's trying to do some alchemy. It doesn't ever get to the level of what it was before, but, you know, discover some things about the world past. Um, let's kind of get a look here at all the different characters as well. I guess that'll become party members. Um, and one thing that I really like about Gus is their character models have gotten really, really good in the last uh, couple iterations of these games. Um, although I find their environment stuff is still kind of lacking a little bit, but it's gotten better. Um, which is kind of weird though, because in another game that Gus has done, Knights of Azure, I thought that game actually looked really nice, and the character models were really uh, good too. Better than this game, it seems. And I'm not sure which one came out first in Japan, although Knights of Azure did come out a couple months before this game, though, so... Looks like we're on day two. Okay, let's not waste any time. Can you teach me some stuff, Pakta? You're quite enthusiastic. Yeah, I don't want to be a novice forever. <laughs> Very well. 
Try synthesizing something first. Synthesis? I can do that. Let's see, materials, materials... Oh. What's wrong? I used all my materials when I made that bird medicine. I have nothing left. Then it seems you need to gather some. Is there a place nearby where you can do that? Yeah, I know of a place, but... Poonie appeared there, so I'm scared to go alone. Oh, right! I can have Monica come with me! Monica? Is that the girl who was with you yesterday? Yeah, she's actually really strong! I see. Then you should be safe. Very well, please be careful. Huh? You're not coming too? As you can see, even if I was to go, I wouldn't be able to fight. Seeing how I'm a book and all. Oh, that's right. Okay, I'll be off then. Yes, try to come back quickly. Time is finite after all. If you take too long, I won't have as much time to teach you alchemy. <laughs> You're right. Okay, I'll try to hurry back. Hmm, it makes it seem like there's a bit of a time limit, but... I don't think there is. At least from what I've read of this game, there isn't. Um, let's just check out events here. Important events. Which says we have to go invite Monica and go gather materials. Um, now, so we'll take a break here. Um, kind of enjoying the little premise of this one. Can we talk to the book? Still a lot to teach you. Okay. So uh, next time we'll go and talk to Monica and then go out and fight some punies and gather some materials so that we can do more alchemy. So, as always, thanks for watching, and until next time.